Uh, what I would like to do is have each of the panelists give us an opening shot across the bow. Tell us something that they think this audience needs to be talking about, needs to be thinking about in terms of the future of media. It really has to, uh, gets down to this idea that I've been sort of thinking about for a while, this notion of uh, the uh, importance of hyper-relevance for content in terms of engaging consumers online. And uh, for those of you who were here in the session yesterday, uh, Renu um, was presenting the macro, macro trends and talked about personalization. And I think that there's a pretty significant difference between personalization and hyper-relevance. I think personalization is really focused on the, the notion of uh, I as a user selecting my sort of desired experience, where hyper-relevance really falls on the, shoulder, on the shoulders of us as marketers and media professionals to make sure that we're delivering content of the highest value and the highest order to our, our, our potential audiences. And me being on the sort of earned media side with uh, Conan Wolf focusing on uh, public relations and earned media, that is really uh, you know, ever, ever, so, uh, ever so important. Um, I think you know, we've, seen a, we've sort of seen something very interesting happen, which I think relates to what you were saying, Mike, around the disclosure of, da uh, the disclosure of data and information. And I think if you thought about the sort of the old mo uh, mode of uh, you know, doing uh, media planning and thinking about your, your media strategy, whether that was earned or paid, you know, you'd talk to your client, you'd find out about the brand and the product that you were uh, launching, you'd take a look at your target audience, 35 to 54, uh, you'd take a look at their media consumption habits, and there'd be a lot of time sort of invested in the, in the research of that, uh, of that individual or that group of individuals and segmenting it by demographic. What we've seen in terms of social media is the sort of blending of demographics and interest areas and, and all of the user generated data points that are given to us as, as media professionals. And so hyper relevance really relies on our <coughs> intuition to make the most of that and to be responsible with the content that we're creating. And so I guess as it relates to this notion of my pottery interests, functional ceramics, I, I kind of believe personally and intrinsically that the highest order of value is to create something that, uh, to create something that is of value and can be used in personal life on a day-to-day -day basis and enhances the value of, uh, of the daily experience of, of its owner or, or of its user. And so in that regard, I sort of think about, I think about marketing and creating content and campaigns for our clients and our clients' brands in very much the same way.